Was he in a fit of jealous rage or in a fight for his life? For the past two weeks, that's been the debate inside a Pueblo courtroom. Tonight, Andrew Barros has his verdict. Good evening, I'm Heather Skold. And I'm Bart Bedsoll. Thanks for making us your choice for news at 10 o'clock. He admits he shot and killed a man and wounded another, but was it cold-blooded murder or self-defense? A Pueblo jury has made its decision finding defendant Andrew Barros not guilty of murder earlier this afternoon. KRDO News Channel 13, Spencer Soysher joins us live in studio now after speaking with the defense attorney who made it all happen. Spencer. Pardon Heather, Andrew Barros has been in jail for 14 months. There's no bail when you're charged with first degree murder, but tonight he's walking out a free man. His attorney successfully arguing that he had no choice but to shoot first. These people knew each other very well. My client knew who he was dealing with. On Monday, Andrew Barros was found not guilty of murdering Carlos Lerma. In September of 2021, Barrow shot Lerma in front of a home on Wyoming Avenue in Pueblo. Witnesses told police that Barrows had become convinced that Lerma was sleeping with his wife and that he'd called him to the home specifically to confront him in person. He was acting in self-defense. But defense attorney Carl Tamler was successful in painting a different picture for the jury. He says it was Lerma who was the aggressor that day and had pulled up in front of the house with the express intent of killing Barrows. When they came up the way they did, he knew that uh, there was a serious circumstance going on. And he came out armed with his handgun down at his side. And the moment that the, uh, the gun was drawn on him, he did what he had to do. Barrows turned himself into police a week after the shooting and has been in jail ever since. When the verdict came down, his attorney says Barrows gripped his arm and told him thank you. He was found not guilty on all four charges from that July day. But his attorney also tells us Barrows still harbors serious regrets about that day, saying Lerma wasn't just some stranger. Andrew Barrows has always been remorseful for what happened. The gentleman who died in this case was his best friend. He's not happy about what happened. It was a tragedy. It was a tragedy that affected two families. Nobody's happy about the outcome. It took the jury less than a full day to return the not guilty verdict. The district attorney's office in Pueblo told us tonight that it's disappointed for Carlos Lerma's family, but they, quote, respect the sanctity of the verdict. Reporting live in studio, I'm Spencer Soysher for KRDO News Channel 13. Spencer, thanks.